Thanks for tuning in. Today we're going to be reviewing the Veloso Men's Block Print Special Edition Jersey, the Ultralight Bib Shorts, and the Ultralight Gloves. As the temperatures go up, even a short ride can become a challenge. That's why it's important to have comfortable and breathable summer road cycling kit. Today we're going to be looking at the Men's Road Cycling Kit from Velocio. That's optimized for lightweight and breathability. If you're not familiar with Velocio, they're an Italian company that was launched in 2014 and founded on the principles of design, responsibility, and culture. As you can see, they're also very sustainable using these biodegradable bags for the packaging, so there's minimal waste in the transportation when they ship it to you. They also have a 30-day signature guarantee, which means if none of these fit, or if you don't like them, you just wash them and send them back for a refund. We'll go ahead and go over the individual items, I'll go over the specs as we do that. So, the jersey here is the Bach Print Special Edition jersey. You can see it has a limited edition block print style to it. It's made of recycled ultra light knit fabric and retails for $179. It's UPF 30 rated. So definitely a great item for summer riding. And it has reflective details such as a reflective logo and some of the trim pieces on here for better visibility at night. It has a zippered pocket on the back in addition to the three main pockets with these little security flaps as well to prevent things from sliding out. And finally, it has a full front zipper that's a YKK cam lock zipper with zipper garages on both the top and bottom to prevent it from rubbing against your skin. Now we'll look at the bib shorts. These are the ultra light bib shorts. They're designed for summer as the name implies and it's one of the lightest weight bib shorts that Velocio currently offers. It's $249 and designed for really warm weather riding without any additional bulk. It's made of 140 GSM woven fabric with medium compression and it has a five panel aerodynamic design that's supposed to minimize waste and really have a form fitting design to it. You have seamless bib straps here and I always recommend bib shorts as you don't get any of the rise with the normal bibs but with the strapless bib short straps you can see very comfortable and there's no extra material on here so nothing to nothing abrasive next we'll look at the gloves so these are the ultra light gloves retail price on this is the 39 dollars and it's pared down from their race gloves so no padding it's really designed to optimize performance it has a UPF 50 uh, Lycra backing to it to prevent you from getting suntanned while you're riding. Strapless design to minimize any bulk and prevent any abrasion against your skin. And it has silicone print logo that provides a little bit of grip and again minimizes any bulk from the fabric. You have a micro suede palm and again non padded that's designed for really great feel and as well as grip. In terms of what comes in the packaging, pretty simple. All of them just come with the basic tags and the items themselves. Now let's take a closer look at the fit and finish of the special edition jersey. Now these are designed the same specification as Velocio signature jerseys, but feature a special prints. What we have here is the block print. This one's inspired by printmakers and organic patterns. So it almost looks like an animal print mixed in with a geometric print. It's available in three different colors. We have the fire red here, which almost looks like an orange in person, as well as a deep sea, which is a blue black, blue and white variation, as well as the charcoal, which is a black and white, almost like a zebra print. It's available in everything from X, extra small all the way to 4XL with size specific patterns to match every body type. And you can see on the front, it's a traditional jersey construction with a full front zipper, double zipper garages, which are these little covers here, and that prevents the zipper from chafing against anything on the front and back. This is a YKK cam lock zipper. So nice smooth operation. And you can see here again on the top, you have the zipper garage and that's really nice. So you don't feel the zipper rubbing against your uh, chin when you're riding. It's definitely a summer style jersey. You can see very thin and elastic and an anatomical design that's really form fitting. So it compresses against you. You have raglan sleeves. You can see there's no 
uh, seam along the shoulder. So it gives you nice mobility and again, more comfort. The sleeves are also really short, these little cuffs here on, and these double-sided fabric for additional comfort. Minimal branding here, you just have Velocio on the top. These are also a reflective, so at night you have additional visibility, uh, which really isn't necessary on the red and white jersey, but for other jerseys at night, definitely makes a difference. And that's about it. There's not much logos on here. Again, you have Velocio on the side but very minimal, so a nice sleek look, and especially in the block print will stand out. You can see on the back, it is a drop tail design. So the front actually, the back extends further than the front, and that means you have additional coverage, especially when you're in arrow position and tucked down, you won't get a lot of bulk. You have a three zipper, a three pocket design with a zippered additional pocket. And what's interesting about this is they have something called a security flap. And this is additional material here that's a little bit grippy. And that holds the objects in there. So if you're going and pulling something out, your credit card or smaller items will definitely get caught in that and help them from sliding, from accidentally sliding out. You also have the zippered pocket here. And that's nice for credit cards, cash, or other small items. And otherwise, nice large pockets. And they're, they're also secured here with additional seems to prevent them from sagging as you carry larger loads. You can also see the reflective details here with these little side panels on the sleeves as well, both sleeves and the side. So definitely nice little details, very elastic. You can see almost see-through. This is not the most breathable version they have. They also have the radiator ones, which are almost see-through, but this is a good blend between the two. It's a lightweight recycled knit material that has good breathability, but still more solid than some of their almost mesh style jerseys. Now let's take a look at the fin finish of the ultralight bib shorts. These are actually 30% lighter than Velocio's signature shorts and are optimized for long all day rides and warm weather. You can see it has an innovative knit construction, very flexible and elastic that provides good breathability on the road. It also has a medium compression fit, similar to their other bib shorts, which means it's nice and form fitting you won't get any flapping in the wind. There's a five panel design here. So you have a side piece, the front piece, and again, the little wraparound pieces to complete it. So it's really designed to match your shape. And with each size, the pattern is adjusted to make sure it form fits. Very minimal branding, just Velocio logos here. And these are reflective, which again, really nice feature to have, especially when you're riding with black clothing to make sure you're seen in low light situations. Now, if you're wondering whether you should get bib shorts or shorts, I always recommend bib shorts. They're much more comfortable as there is no seam right along your waist and it doesn't rise or lower as the straps hold it in place securely. A little less convenient if you need to do bathroom stops as you have to take off the straps, but definitely worthwhile, especially if you do a longer rides. The straps here are also quite unique. They use a seamless design. So you can see one piece of elastic all the way along and it crisscrosses at the top. So this comes at the top and it folds over. So very simple design and the nice thing about them, they're wide too, so they won't dig into your back or shoulders when you're wearing them. As with any bib short, the most critical component is the chamois. This is part of their proprietary design. And you can see nice and wide, and these are really great for long rides. So it's optimized to have a good balance between comfort and uh, endurance. So you can see it has a nice thick intersection along the sides. In the middle, it's a lighter weight material and you have this nice zigzag stitching along the edges that extends all the way up in the front and extends a little along the rears. So definitely optimized for longer rides and form fitting. You also have little details that you expect on bib shorts, like the non-slip cuffs along the leggies on the legs. So each side has these non-slip material and this helps it from prevent it from rising. And if you're wearing leg warmers, you can tuck them underneath here and it really holds them in place. Now let's take a closer look at the fit and finish of the lightweight gloves. Now these are pared down from the race gloves Velocio offers. They're non-padded no strap, so really designed to minimize bulk. And they even drop the terry cloth little inner sleeve for a nose wipe just to eliminate some of the bulk. 
It's available in quite a few colors. You can see the red here really pops, but you can totally mix and match this, and it's available in a wide range of sizes to match any size hand. And you can see when you put these on, there is no Velcro strap, so it's very similar to the POC. It makes it a little less convenient to put on and take off, and very form-fitting once you put them on. You can see here, it fits nice and tight, and being elastic backing, the Lycra uh, top cover is really soft, and it's uh, nicely expands. You have these little pulls on the front and the top to help take it off and put it on. And this dual color scheme with this micro suede on the palm with the logo on there and then the lycra on the back that's also UPF rated so you don't get a suntan while you're riding. They're short, they're fingerless gloves so you get a lot of traction and as long as you have really nice bar tape you don't really need the padding so you don't miss it. The Velocio logo is also silicone, so it helps with a little bit of grip on your palm as well. Very simple construction otherwise, you can see the stitching on here along the fingers, the basic pull, and then the front and back construction, that nice, nice and form-fitting to your palm. Now let's take a look at the cycling kit on the road. As you can see, the fire red color scheme is quite bright, so you'll make sure you're visible even during the daytime. And it's a great looking kit, especially in combination with the socks. Uh, everything matches up really well, except for the jersey, which is a little more orange than red, as you can see. Overall, really impressed with the design. They're comfortable, and especially in warm days. Provide nice ventilation and cooling. And especially the bib shorts. They're comfortable for all-day rides or short rides, as they have a nice chamois in there that provides good comfort, no pressure points. And with the light compressive fabric, it also helps you recover a little bit quicker. Overall, the, everything has a nice build quality. All the edges are really well done. There's no bulky seams. And even the rear pockets on the jersey are all really easy to access. And that zipper pocket is perfect for credit cards, keys, or smaller items that you want to have secured. Now combined, uh, the total kit looks really good together. And you can see here, even the gloves uh, match well. And they have that nice micro suede palm. So it gives you a nice grip, especially if you have the good uh, bar tape on your handlebars already. Now let's go over the scorecard for the Velocio Summer Cycling Kit. We're going to grade the jersey, bib short, and gloves on three different categories, design, sizing, and comfort. For the jersey, we'd give it an A- in design. It's a great looking jersey, but the color doesn't quite match the other fire red products in Velocio's catalog. Size is an A. It's a nice form fit, and comfort's also an A. There's not much bulk, and with the extended hem on the rear, Something that stays in place whether you're on the drops or the handlebars. The bib shorts would give it an A for design, an A for sizing, an A for comfort. They're really lightweight, have a nice compression to provide a little bit of recovery and really stay in place. So even on really long rides, you stay cool and comfortable. And finally, the ultralight gloves would also give it an A across the board. They're lightweight, they're non padded, so not for everybody. And with the strapless design, it's a little bit more difficult to put on and off. But beyond that, they're really comfortable. And with the micro suede palm, they also have nice grip. Thanks for watching this review. Don't forget to like and subscribe. You can see more content from us on our website at thesweetcyclist.com, as well as follow us on Instagram at thesweetcyclist. This is The Sweet Cyclist reminding you to enjoy the ride.